I sat down near the window Looking up at the trees in the lane I saw a man in a wheel Welcome to our channel Lightning Vision. Today Mother will talk to us about well maybe Hollywood. <laughs> Welcome Mother. Hollywood and the power of women. Mother, we hear so many uh, events or you know things that are happening in Hollywood like the actresses are accusing uh, directors, uh, singers also like many many women are uh, saying that men took advantage of them. So you you were just talking to me about the power of women. Uh, so can you explain to us um, what role have women in 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 the events, the, these sad events? Yes. Um, well, uh, I I'm singing myself, so I, I that was a situ situation that I've lived, and it was very interesting. I mean, um, it is true that in this in that kind of business, the the, the show business in many from many uh, points of view. Um, those who are, who are in the higher positions and who have the responsibility or, or the key figures on what we imagine the road to success, I won't say that they all, they all behave like that, but many might give it a try if they have an attractive person in front of them. Um, in the first place you can say that it all depends on the woman, unless the man is uh, using aggression and, 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 and uh, physical force to, 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 to dominate the woman. But um, before, it come, before a man jumps up and, 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 and jumps on the woman, well, in most of the cases there, there has been a moment where they were sitting in front of each other or standing in front, in front of each other. And um, I think that women are far more powerful in a positive or in a negative way than they, they, they know of themselves. Because even if a man is uh, starting to look at your <laughs> attributes, or even lower, I don't know, it depends on what you're wearing, um, you do not have to follow him in that kind of attitude. I want to say that women have a lot of power that they do not use, that they are not aware of. Because you can say that a man, in spite of everything, he can never be a mother. So from a psychological point of view, he is always her son. And that is where the power of women starts. It's you who decide if he will become your partner in this interaction. Or he will be your son. That is the first thing that's very important to know for women. Because that is the, the, the basic psychological relationship between men and women. If you give him this power to, to rise up and to become equal with you or even to dominate you, he is not completely responsible of that himself alone. I mean, you are also responsible in this situation. So accusing man of abuse of power, there is something true in it when, when, you, when you see that man may use their position to try to invite you to do things with them that you perhaps don't want. But I have seen that in most cases you can say yes or no as a woman. And the idea that this man can become aggressive and, and overwhelm you, that is in very, that's not in most of the cases, that's in rare cases, that happens. But I, I think eight or nine out of ten situations, it's not in that way that it starts. So, even if the woman doesn't do anything and she's not inviting and she's decently clothed and everything you want, if he starts inviting her 
for other things that have nothing to do with the subject they are talk talking about, you have to be two for that. And now the difficulty is that the woman in, and that has to do with show business, but also outside of the show business. If the woman somehow has an interest in keeping this man and, and, and she thinks she needs what he has, uh, uh, she needs uh, the role in, in, in the film or she needs uh, the concert hall or she needs his, his approval in one way or another or his support, she cannot do without him. That is the danger. And then she might more or less accept. And if she more or less gives in on a psychological level, even in a very subtle way, he might take advantage of her. But she has given her consent. She has given her consent. She has said in one way or another, more or less yes. Because she's afraid to lose the, the, the opportunity. The opportunity. We have to realize this. I once met a man who said to me, he said, I've, had, I've known many women. It was, was true what he said. He said, well, I can tell you, mother, nothing happens in a relationship that she doesn't want. For one reason or another. If she doesn't accept it, it will not happen. Unless the man is really very, uh, prime, uh, 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 like an ape man, what do you call it, a, gor a gorilla, and he, 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 he jumps on her. But as I said, that is a rare case. Now, why women accept certain things? And up to what degree, or, 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 or what makes in them that they... they somehow give in without giving in is because they need something in this situation from that man. Mm. And that is where women go wrong because at this moment many actresses or, or people out of the show business or even uh, women were in working all kinds of working situations start accusing men at, that at a certain moment in their lives they had men abused of, of her. They're certainly right, those women. I, I think many of them tell the truth. But they never talk or they are not, I would say, they, they are not, I would say they're not aware of their own participation in the situation because they were afraid to lose the job, because they wanted a promotion, because they wanted more money, because they wanted I don't know what. But the woman who attracts that kind of situations and it gets out of hand has participated in one way or another mm -hmm. even if it is just by being afraid to lose the opportunity and that's where women should be far more aware because mm -hmm. it's not said but it's felt like it it's is the reason why they more or less open up and then the man mm -hmm. feels that and mm -hmm. uses it but if she would have said no, with you or without you, mm. then it would not have happened. In most of the cases, there are exceptions. Mm -hmm. Because she would have said, listen, you give me this role or this opportunity, or you don't. Yeah. But if it's my destiny, it will happen anyway, with you or without you. Yeah. I just read actually about an actress who did this and she, she could find an alternative. Yes, yeah. because, and this is one of the reasons why, pe why it's, it's sad that people do not believe in God anymore or in the soul or in something that leads, our, so, something that's like a leading threat in our lives. I mean, God does not ask you to get late with that man to, or to have a role. Mm -hmm. I mean, if it's your destiny to have that role, you will have it with him or without him. And something in this universe, and you have to give this a chance in your life. If you say no to this man, you will see what happens. Perhaps you will not get a role. And then afterwards say, I'm glad that I didn't have it. It was not for me. But if it was for you, you will get it. 
But we need, as women, more consciousness, mm -hmm. knowing how things work in life, and more strength. I do not think that women accept this kind of situation, even in an unconscious way, because they're really weak. But it's ignorance. They are afraid that they will not have the, 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 what they would like to have. But that's not true. You will have it if it's for you, or you will not have it. And whatever you do, you will not have it. That should become our conviction as women. Then we will not be victims anymore. Nobody can then uh, deviate us. Because I live, I believe and I live that no intelligence in this universe will ask from me degrading situations or degrading proposals to obtain whatever. Because it's this God who is leading the situation and my destiny and not that man. That should become our conviction then we should also accept that there are moments that we will not get what we want. But perhaps it's not for, for our own good. Mm -hmm. Or the, 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 the forces that lead our destiny will take it another way around and we'll, we will get it anyway. But we, we should have other convictions and not uh, give in. To, to, to mundane people in front of us that say, yes, I can pay a way of gold. To, to, that's impossible. I, I was in situations where there were people in front of me were also insinuating, uh, if I could pass one day in the office without uh, my, my secretary uh, just alone, then, uh, th then we could talk about it. Well, of course I understood what he meant, because I would say, well, you talk about it when it's the two of us, or we don't talk. But he did not invite me to talk, uh, apparently. So, and then suddenly something in my intuition said, listen, this man can give you the concert hall, but he can never give you the public. So, what the heck? Concert halls you can have in other places. I, I, want, to, I, I want to say with this that whether my career was working out well or not, did absolutely not depend on that man. That, man. Mm -hmm. that were, was in the hands of other forces. Mm -hmm. Because it has to do with, 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 it did not have to do with a, a role in the film, or it has to do with, with other factors in life that he does not control. And he's just using his, his power to provoke illusions in you. But that's, that's not the reality. So I would say, <coughs> women that are, are in, in in all kinds of situations in life, uh, victims of men that abuse of them. The first problem of those women is, is some kind of illusion in the situation. Because they, 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 they needed the money, the job, they wanted a career. They thought they needed the advantages of, of the situation, of what this man could offer. But that's an illusion. You will be where you have to be because something else in this universe has, has, has decided upon that. And you will get there with that man or without him. And nobody in this whole universe will ask you to, 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 to accept what he is asking from you. That's impossible. <clears throat> if you do that, it's because you are ignorant. Or he is he's forcing you. But I already said this is more rare, far more rare. And um, it's in ignorance. This man <coughs> can basically not do for you what you think. But he's just making believe you believe that. Mm -hmm. And it's not true. So I would say he has no power over you. Unless you give him the power. That doesn't mean that we have to um, start uh, accusing the women and say, oh, there are bad women. No, no, they were ignorant or in illusion. And, and, and yes, he abused of it, but she's not, uh, not, not a victim. Yes, I think women have far more, uh, they, they are not aware of their, the powers they, they, they possess. And um, they, they are, they're ignorant in, in, in a way that they think that they need that man for one way or another, for one thing or another. So, 
in that way that, that man gets power over them. Mm -hmm. But that's not true. And then we can also talk perhaps in the next video about clothing. What do sexy clothes, yes or not, do for, for us? We can talk about it if you want to, but you will see it's the same, same idea. Mm -hmm. It depends on other factors. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Mother. So much wisdom and it's, it's really good that you're here because we, we learn and we, uh, we can apply this wisdom in our daily lives. Because I think we, we, um, we lost it with the years of, of like women working and, and being away from home and then being too busy and don't we, we think we need to make money and all this. So thanks again. Okay, so I'm leaving you on the beautiful song uh, by the group Mother. So we'll see you very soon. Goodbye. I sat down near the window Looking up at the trees in the lane I saw a man in a wheelchair And a dog who seemed lost in the rain There was a child that was crying and a mother who seemed in despair Many questions cropped up in my mind What were they all doing there? And with a sword made of fire He is dividing the world into two One side the just and the righteous On the other the honest and true there is a light that is shining In every heart that is touched by His love It is for them that He's striving With patience, courageously marching in front Yes, with a sword made of fire Some are poor, some are wealthy Some are weak Whereas others are strong Some succeed, some go under Some repeat the same errors lifelong Some eat bread full of butter Some eat pastries and others just rice There are those who do not seem to care Where others, they try to be nice and with a sword made of fire He is dividing the world into two One side the just and the righteous On the other the honest and true There is a light that is shining In every heart that is touched by His love It is for them that He's striving With patience, courageously marching in front Please don't stay on the surface Each detail of our life is profound Watch the causes and effects And see how life's wheel turns around Every day we're invited To choose again for the wrong or the right There's a spirit who's working behind it who dares to stand on his side? There is a light that is shining in every heart that is touched by His love. It is for them that He's striving with patience, courageously marching in front.